for more great videos and learning tutorials, or to download the exercises that go with these videos, please visit our website at www.createthenet.com. That was www.createthenet.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create hyperlinks inside of Dreamweaver CS5. In the next video, we'll show you how to make some specialized hyperlinks. But in this video, we're just going to see how to create links from one page to another. You can see here I've actually added some information to the home page on my website. And I sort of had a little navigation system up here. The four pages on my site are home page, company services, about us, and contact information. And you can see those pages over here. So what we want to do is we want to create links to each one of those pages from these pieces of text here. So I'm going to go ahead and first highlight home page. I'm just going to highlight that text. And then I'm going to come down here to the link box. And this is in my properties panel. Now there's a couple different ways that you can do this. What I usually do is I click the little yellow folder icon here. And that will allow me to browse for the file. When I click that, you're going to see it opens up. It's actually going to open up to the root directory. And there is my home page, index.htm. So I'm going to go ahead and select that. And then I'm going to go ahead and click OK right here. So now I have a hyperlink to take me back to the home page. Now I'm going to go ahead and highlight company services and do the exact same thing. I come down here to properties. I find the link box and I click that yellow folder icon. Again, that will allow me to select whatever file or go into other folders in my site, whatever file I want to link to. So this is about company services, so I'm going to select services and click OK. And I have a second hyperlink. Now a quicker way to do this for some people is to highlight the text and instead of clicking on the little yellow folder icon, if you can actually see the file over here in your files panel, you can use this shortcut tool, point to file tool. So I want the about us text to link us to about.htm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to point right at that, press and hold, and as I hold you're going to see a line forms. Again, I haven't released my mouse, then I'm going to go ahead and point at about and release, and that link is now created. Finally, I'll go ahead and do contact information. I'll go ahead and highlight that. And then I'm going to go ahead and click the yellow folder icon. And I want to go ahead and select contact.htm and then click OK. So now I have the four links to the four pages that are in my site. The next thing that I have to do is I have to add these same links to the other pages. Because right now they're just on the home page. And you'll see I've opened up my pages up here at the top. If I go to services, you'll see there's a blank spot, but no menu items. Same thing for about and for contact. Now, I could go type in this information and create the links manually. But an easier way to do it is just going to be coming back to my index page, highlighting my menu, going to edit and copy. You could also use the keyboard shortcut if you want, or you can right click on items. Then I'm going to come to services, and again you could go to edit, paste, or what I'd usually do is right click, and then select paste. And that's going to paste those links in. Come to about, and we'll paste that in there, there we go. And finally contact, we're going to right click and paste that in there. And again notice the asterisks to the right of each one of my page names indicating that there are unsaved changes. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to File and Save All. And that's all there is to creating a simple hyperlink instead of Dreamweaver CS5. If you'd like to find out more information about Adobe Dreamweaver or other Adobe Creative products such as Photoshop, Fireworks, or InDesign, be sure to visit our website at www createtheweb.com. That's www.createtheweb.com. For more great videos and learning tutorials, or to download the exercises that go with these videos, please visit our website at www.createthenet.com. 
That was www.createthenet.com.